So bad news, ladies and gentlemen. Turkey has lost. So I don't know if he is going to get an upgrade, guys. Let's double check the rules real quick. I want to thank uh, Autos and Linea because he did help me um, get this key. Packed this card for me and he was like, do you want to review it? And I was like, might as well. And this was before I knew the result of Turkey and Italy. Come on, let's see where it is. There it is. Launch event 93. If you get three wins, you get plus two overall. So this card is probably not going to get upgraded unless they advance. And maybe if they beat Switzerland and Wales and then maybe the first group, maybe this card will be upgraded. But it still is a fantastic card regardless. And that's why we're going to be trying them out. I know a lot of League 1 guys want to link him and the Gilmas up. So you get the perfect hyperlink. I believe they're from the same nation. So it's going to be a good test to see if this guy can hold it down in Division Rivals. His card is nasty. I'm not going to tell you right now. 6-1, medium, medium, left footed. Four-star skill moves. Four-star weak foot. Beautiful stuff there. And I'm interested to see if the price on this card is affected by anything. He's still 100k, man. That is pretty good for a 92 rated card. He is cheap. He looks like a monster. I am going to be playing him up at striker with probably a hunter chemistry style just to max out the pace as you see on the screen 86 acceleration 94 sprint speed will go up to basically 98 98 99 pace with a hunter chemistry style and you love that on to the shooting of 94 94 attack positioning 91 finishing 99 shot power elite level shooting basically maxed out if you ask me on to the passing of 94 definitely can play cam and with an engine chemistry style he would be a phenomenal cam he has 94 vision 96 short passing and 90 long passing as well on to the dribbling of 94 90 agility 88 balance that is a little bit worrisome he is 6-1 so i don't know his body type i never played with this player of the month so i don't know if he feels heavy or not but what i do know is that he can dribble the lights out guys 96 ball control 96 dribbling and 90 composure now on two the physical of 90, 96 stamina, she lasted the whole game, 90 strength, 90 aggression. That is fantastic, guys. And I just noticed that every offensive stat is in the 90s. That is crazy for a 100k card. And lastly, the player traits. Oh my goodness, he has everything you want. Finesse shot, flare, long shot taker, outside the foot shot, and technical dribbler. I'm so excited to try out this 100k beast. Is he worth it? Is he not? Should you pick him up for your League 1 side? We're going to be answering all those questions next. Vamos, Jasiki. Great pass. To war. Let's go. The League 1 players. All right. Kaka. Jasiki. Se viene Jasiki. Let's go. What a golazo. Goal, 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 goal. That is what I'm talking about. He snuck it in there. And Yusuf Jasiki. I'm going to call him that, guys. I'm probably mispronouncing that name. Scores a golazo. And we have tied up the ball game. What a way to introduce yourself to Foot Leo FC. And what a great finish from the striker, man. Vamos a war. Jasiki. Look at that beautiful pass to Ricardo Kaká. Jasiki. Let's go. Oh, he almost did that spin move. Ah, oh, that that 6-1 frame of his. Look at the dribbling. Ah, yeah, yeah. I'm trying to do a spin move right there, but he feels pretty good on ball. Makaleli. Seedorf. Oh, what a beautiful ball control, and I thought he was going to move the goalkeeper right there. Good run. I like the attacking AI. Let's see if we can get a corner right here with him. He does have a high jumping and heading accuracy. Oh, that's in. Ah, yeah, yeah. Wow. 100k for this card. What a finish. Hey, come down with your head, man. Ooh, 
my goodness, that was about to be the golazo of the century right there. What a play, but unfortunately we get unlucky and we hit the post on that left foot. I should have just gotten the ball a little bit and gotten on balance. But so far, men of the match, five attempts, two goals for Yusuf Jasiki, the 100k beast. He's proving his worth, guys. Nice, nice coverage right there. Good interception and great pass. Jasiki. That the vamos a war. Can we get the assist? Can we get the assist? And I thought he was going to move the goalkeeper right there. But beautiful play up top between Owar and Jasiki. Let's see if we can get finally get a corner goal right here. Vamos. Ay. What a golazo, guys. A little bit fortunate, I'm not going to lie. But... We end up getting the goal with Jasiki. Hat trick alert has happened. And beautiful finesse right there. We did get that fortunate bounce. And I'm literally liking this card's finishing, guys. Hunter might be the way to go. Great standing tackle right there from Sakaria once again. Oh, what a great run. So, yeah, he, I think he's offside. I think he's offside right there. But, I mean, his attacking AI is very aggressive. Oh my God, he's making some incredible runs. I do have him on uh, getting behind. And he's applying it perfectly. Look at that movement for a 6-1 player to do. What? A fantastic card, and I'm not even exaggerating, guys. My opponent is pretty good, but he is having trouble defending this 92 rated Jasiki, man. Wow. I'm a what a through ball. Let's go. Look at that power, guys. The power and the miss. Ah, yeah, yeah. He was out, out bodying La Croix team of the season. If you can do that, you know you are pretty good in the game. You love that. Unfortunate finish right there. I kind of let the directional shot go. And I was trying to shield him for my life. I'm glad he's able to do it, though. Wow, guys. This 100k beast definitely did impress me. And you saw what he did against a very, very tough opponent. He was having his way and he scored four goals on the evening. If it wasn't for that post, it could have been five goals and we could have gotten the W. So let's go straight into the pros. Number one is going to be that 94 sprint speed, man. I really like that and it is felt on the pitch for a 6-1 player to have tremendous pace is rare. And Jasiki definitely does have and you do feel that on the pitch. On to the next pro is going to be that 91 finishing. Definitely good uh, from the finishing department. Four goals left or right. It doesn't really matter. He will put it in the back of the net onto the next pro is going to be that 94 passing he will be a phenomenal cam if you do play him in that position onto the next pro is going to be that 96 ball control and 96 dribbling man i'm really impressed by a 6-1 uh dribbling like Lionel messi and that is what jasiki does he keeps the ball glued to his foot and you love it and then the last pro is going to be that 90 strength, guys. He is able to hold off players just like Lacroix in the second half of the first game. And yeah, guys, that's all you have to do. If you want to just shield, you definitely can. And you'll be on your way to scoring a lot of goals. And now on to the cons. The only con on this card that I can think of, guys, has to be the 86 acceleration. I would highly, highly recommend you increase that with the Hunto or and Catalyst. I think that's the best two chemistry styles to go. And then, yeah, guys, on to the Leo tips. I would play this card at striker at stay forward, getting behind. His attacking AI is ridiculous. 94 attack positioning, and you do feel it. He makes some crazy runs, and that'll help you space out the floor and help you with the through ball meta. And he will be able to score a lot of goals and definitely can play cam. That's another Leo tip I wanted to add for you today. And now on to the meta rating. Meta rating on this card, I'm going to give it an 8 out of 10. He is a meta, but he is lacking a little bit in the agility and balance to make 
become an incredible super meta player like a Ben Yedder or, you know, those type of players there. And now to the final rating, I'm going to give it an 8.5 out of 10. I really enjoyed this card and for 90k, that's how much I sold him for. He is a crazy value for your coins, a very fun, usable card. And if you're a League One fan, you can do Bamba, Jasiki, Gilmas, or you can do Bamba, Jasiki, Renato Sanchez. A lot of good options for links there. But anyways, I will conclude today's review. Hopefully, helped you out in the setting whether you want to get this card or not. And you enjoyed this review. Before I let you go, I just want to say thank you so much for your support on Instagram and YouTube lately. I have been killing it with the support, and I love seeing that, guys. Please take a second out of your day, like this video, subscribe to the channel, and expect more reviews later on. This is Leo. I bid you goodbye and good night.